Hi everyone, I'm Larry the Butcher. I think it's about time we got to better know another craft beer. First beer of box number four. We are going to the great metropolis of Waterloo to try Innocente, which I believe is Italian. Uh, Waterloo is not. Um, and what we're going to try, Innoslanche, which is not Italian either. It's, it's Gaelic. Um, Inno, I'm not too sure what it means, but Slanche means um, welcome. I think Slanche means welcome. I better check that. Slanche is a basic form in Irish Gaelic. Variations of this toast mean Slanche, Maheth, good health in Irish. Maheth being the limited form of Maheth, good. Slanche, here, here we go from irishcentral.com, 25th of June 2016, so it's current. Slanche is the thing you say before you take your first sip of your pint of Guinness. I'm not drinking Guinness today. I love drinking Guinness though. You guys know I love drinking Guinness. Slanche is the most used Irish expression in America. Um, our readers survey discovered Slanche meaning good health. Slanche means good health. Slancha, Slancha, Slancha. Slancha. So let's learn a little bit about the beer. In a Slancha. Slancha. A true representation of the classic Irish style, deep ruby red color and tan head leads to a distinct malty rosy note. Rich caramel and roasted malt flavors fade to a clean dry finish. That's what it says right there. You can read it now. <laughs> I do like the bottle, but if you guys saw the unboxing video where I had the nine beers and three of these were from, from Innocente, I was critical because the logo here is the same as the logo here, but on two other bottles, there's different logos or logos missing at all on the bottle and um, what I do once in a while is you know I give you guys props because you put a brood on date which is bottled on date which is great but no social media um, to find out where I can buy this beer nothing's there and you guys want to sell bottles don't you but what do I know I'm just an idiot with a camera um, that being said I would do a tour of your brewery let's open this thing up Kind of a thin cap. Yeah. Never done that before. Aaron, have you ever seen that? That's new. Yeah. Yeah. There we go. <laughs> so it is as it says. So it's got that deep ruby. It almost, you know, it gives me my first impression is that it looks like cherry coke. Um, but the 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 bio with you know deep ruby red color and tan head it's it's got it and it, it smells definitely smells malty um I'm, I'm very much looking forward thank you guys slancha a little bit of a hoppy taste sit it, it's grapefruitish but not not overpowering it's not like um ransack the universe was and the thing you know what i really do enjoy that i think you guys have a winner here you get that citrus but it's not i've already forgotten it like my, my palate is already it's gone which is good because um when i had a some of these super hoppy beers i was tasting the citrus from the first dr drink to my in my third and fourth this is like the per almost the perfect blend i gotta learn how to pour this is good have much of an it's nice. This is like an after dinner beer. Cleanse the palate kind of beer. Kind of wind down it's and relax. It's nice. Yeah, it's not. I'm not. I'm not going. Oh, what the hell did I just drink? I'm like. It's just enough. Just enough of of the the hoppy citrus grapefruitish flavor. Um, it's not making me wish for for flapjacks. This is, uh, this is nice. I, I, I don't get a whole lot of aftertaste. Like there's almost no aftertaste. Yeah, it's it's like a nice clean finish, and your yeah. your your um, you forget it enough to want the next drink, which is kind of good. And but it, it's it's like it's the it's, reason why my mom's my mom drinks Coors Light. I think she'd like this beer because the next the previous yeah, sip is easy to forget. Yeah. Yeah. And that's one thing the macro brews, like the, the big guys, 
they they have you have that drink and you're like okay I forget that taste I need another which is kind of what this does in in a good sense um what was the alcohol content on this five five point two percent alcohol um international bitterness unit of 18 um yeah it's it's a thing. a thing it's a thing i have a feeling that it's the other flavors in this the the malt maltiness um multi roasty nose um i think that balances it out which gives a flavor that you know would make you want another would i organize a beer night and have this brewery represented absolutely um my dog's here licking my hands and I'm reminded of that scene in the epic movie um, Strange Brew when they go to give their dog Hosehead a beer. I would definitely drink this again. I would definitely make the trek to Waterloo to go buy a six pack, eight pack, a 12 pack, whatever you guys do. Um, I do like the label. It is pretty much nice and clean, but okay, I just found innocente.ca. It's really small. Um, can you guys see it? It's right there. That's it. So I think that's pretty hard to notice. Under the barcode, that size, I'd put it there with a Facebook and a Twitter logo and what, because all that stuff's free! And you're on Facebook anyway, hanging out, so start a page! You know what I mean? Other than that, I think you guys got a pretty good beer. Flaunt you guys. Ah. So thank you so much for watching. Um, I hope you guys give Inno Slanche a try. Uh, it's a pretty good beer. I, I will definitely have it again. And if you're in Waterloo, and I don't know what the operation looks like, but if they have a brew pub or anything like that, I would definitely walk in and have a pint and try their stuff on. And um, Maybe Steve Onocente is going to be there. Say hi. It's the worst thing that could happen. He could say, go away, I'm making beer. That would be a good thing. So guys, don't forget to like this episode, comment down below. Have you tried any of Innocente's other beers? Um, let me know. Are there any other beers you want me to try? And by all means, if you've enjoyed this video and if you liked, and you've liked a few other videos, please take the time to subscribe. You'll get updates all the time. Thank you very much, and we'll see you later. Slancha.